What's up guys? Um Cody Huffman TV here. I posted a comment on uh what's his name? I I Apple Jailbreaker on his video on how to get Siri. Uh y'all were having problems with the Apple logo getting stuck on the Apple logo. And uh, I'm going to try to help you out on how to get it because I'm I have it. It's right there. 5.1.1 um show you hi Siri greetings see and uh what time is it it is 9.25 p.m. I don't know if you can see that or not, but it says 925. But, um, remind me to watch my TV in five minutes. I updated your reminder. Ready to create it? No. Okay, I won't remind you. But, uh, that's just showing you that it works. So, um, let me get into showing you how to get it. So, um, first you go into City, uh, but this is an iPod, by the way. Got my mustache on the back if you don't see it. Okay. So, what you're going to need to add is the source iHacksRepo.com. So, push edit, add, oh, there you go, and, uh, I, hacks, repo, oh, that's not how you spell that, but you get the gist of it, but I'll put a, probably put it up on the screen, what you gotta type in, but then, I, hacks, repo is right there, so then you, um, you can either click on it or search it, doesn't matter, then you're gonna go, Go download Spite for iOS 5.1 after you have added the source iHacksRepo.com. And then after you do that, you're going to go through the download and you know how it has that black screen where it shows un unpackaging and all that stuff. When it says reboot, don't push reboot. What you're going to want to do is um, go into Red Snow. Here's my red snow. If you're running on Windows, you gotta push run as administrator. So, just so you know. Yeah, yeah. But uh, when you get to this screen, when you get to this screen here, you wanna push extras, and then you wanna push just boot tethered right now and have your uh, iPod hooked up into the computer or iPhone whatever you got and uh, you're gonna click on that and then it's gonna say put in the DFU mode and put it in there first if you already know and then click next put in DFU mode and it'll go through and export with Limera and all that good stuff and then it'll show the pineapple on your iPod and it'll um it'll go through the reboot process without leaving you on the Apple screen so just be um, just be patient with it and then after you do all that stuff with um, Red Snow you'll get your iPod back or iPhone I'm just going to keep saying iPod since I have an iPod okay so now 
get back to the get back to this. Okay, but after you have spite and all that and rebooted with red snow, you want to go to um, go to add, go to manage, do it again, and then edit, add, and then you're gonna want to add the source. Uh, HTTP, all that stuff, com, which some, most of y'all probably already have it, but if you don't, it's X-S-E-L-L-I-Z-E.com. I'll put it up on the screen for you. But after you have that, you're going to search assistant so put in in the search bar assistant server altogether assistant server space installer And then uh, you're gonna you're gonna um, download the assistant service server, and then it's gonna ask you to reboot. And just in case, I don't know if it's gonna lock you up on your Apple home screen. I mean, on your Apple boot logo, whatever you want to call it. But you might as well do the same thing with Red Snow. It takes what two minutes. Uh, reboot it with Red Snow, come back and you'll have it. And after you have that, you, um, after you rebooted and everything and you downloaded Spite, and you've downloaded Assistant Siri Server, you're going to go down to in your settings you're going to go down to all your jailbreak part down here and then you should have spire which is going to be right here and uh, I know you I told you to download spite but when you download spite it puts spire on here you just put a different name but it'll download spire and then you go to and then you go to Siri server which you, what was assistant Siri server and you go through whatever it says on the screen to do it and then it'll give you a whatever you want to call that proxy server. I don't know what it's called. Yeah, proxy server. And then you're gonna um, after you do all that, you're gonna copy whatever which one it gave you. I don't know if it's gonna give you this one or whatever, but <coughs> but um, write that down. Go to Spire and put it in proxy host box right here. And um, then you should uh, have Siri up and running. But uh, this this is the running from Google's API, so it's not the actual Siri. So it's going to be lagging up sometimes. It's not going to be as fast. It's not going to do all the all the most of the things, but it should. It's going to do most, but it can't do all of, like like what actual Siri does. And it's going to say, I'm sorry, I can't help you right now. You're going to have to wait a little bit. Just go to Siri server and push update server. And it'll say update complete. This server is restarting. Please allow 5 to 10 seconds, blah, 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 all that. And then wait. And then it should work fine after you have it. And then just let me show you that it's still working. Hi, Siri. See if it does it again. Greetings. Oh, there it goes. So it works, and uh, it can set reminders. Um, ask what time it is. Uh, here's the weather. What is the weather like in Moore, Oklahoma? One moment, please. This is the forecast for Moore, United States. And uh, there you go. But um, I'm pretty sure I covered everything. 
I'm not sure if you have to go down. I'm pretty sure you have to go download the certificate. And, uh, like the iApple jailbreak or whatever his name is, um, put on there. But I'm not sure. Just do whatever the serious server says. And it worked for me. And I am running 5.1.1, uh, iPod 4th generation. Works fine. Just show you again that I'm on 5.1. There you go. Uh, Bergwin one uh, replied to my comment. Um, I, he asked if the video was going to be up today, so um, I will send you a message on YouTube later tonight or whenever, whenever I actually have the video up because I have to edit it and all that good stuff. But um, where you go? Um. Burge one I have this is how to get it so I'm not sure this is you may have to right there that uh, install certificate I think you may have to get that so uh, it, it I am pretty sure it'll say it in all the stuff that's supposed to tell you in the assistant server but um, thanks for watching and uh, if this helped you uh, like and uh, subscribe and if you need anything else I'll try to help you uh, I'm really good at getting cracked like uh, operating systems and a whole bunch of programs like I'm running Windows 7 right now if you can see I'm supposed to be on Windows Vista I don't know if you can see that I'm supposed to be on Windows Vista, so got that for free. And uh, I got this cool thing called Ocelogix Boost Speed. Um, that's real good for speeding your computer up and deleting unwanted files and defragging your hard drive and stuff. I got that for free. And. Uh, whole lot of other things so just subscribe and there will be more where that came from see y'all